Yeah, you know? Yeah. Um, not super clean, but didn't really matter. Today it's just, you know, first, second, third, fourth. That's what we're going for. So I'm excited that I got first. And, you know, a decent race. Pretty consistent for the season, so I'm happy. Ahead of your goals, you were setting for yourself last spring. Is this one of the moments you envisioned when you were sitting out? Yeah, I was hoping for it. You know, it's one of the things that you know when you sit out a year, you're like, now nah, I got to get back to where I was before, and to get back to that level is a good feeling. You know, knowing that I'm, that I've been doing a lot to, to get back and doing everything right. So you said, I'm excited. Did you ever feel like you wouldn't get back to that point? No, I mean, maybe like six months from surgery, uh, I've been feeling great, but you know, for, for this year at least, I've been feeling really well. You said, you said that this is a stepping stone for the Olympic trials and the Olympics, but how satisfying is it to, to get this title now? It's good. You know, now this, you know, the times are what you know you look for as an athlete, but the races now that I'm be running are going to be all about placing. So top three make the Olympic team. If you win first place in, in Rio, you get the gold medal. So that's really all, all that matters is, is placing, competing well when it comes when the gun goes off. So I think, you know, I did that well today and I'll just keep doing that as the season goes on. Devin, what's it mean to win the 110 in front of these fans at Hayward Field? Um, it means a lot, you know, if, just just like my freshman year when I wasn't expected to win it, it feels the same as now that, that I was expected to win it. You know, the fans are amazing. You know, they, they cheer you as I come onto the track. They cheer me as I get in the block. So it's just a big time. It's, it's, a, it's a good feeling to go out there knowing that people are rooting for you and you don't want to let them down. Is it different being the favorite as opposed to being somebody that nobody was paying that much attention to? Um, when I run, uh, I always think I'm the favorite. So, you know, my freshman year, even though people didn't think I was going to be the favorite, I felt like that. So, um, you know, I just go out there and try to win every time. And, you know, that's what I did today. So I'm happy. kind of glad this is over. It kind of completes the circle now. Shut the door on the injury and all that stuff. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Um, you know, I can say that I'm, you know, pretty much 100% back. Um, you know, now I just have to fine tune some things in the, in the next month. You know, get into a little bit better shape, watch my diet. You know, now that school's over, I can kind of focus on doing all that stuff now. Um, so I'm excited. Are you going to race at Albertine now, child? I don't know. I want to, but um, there's some meets next week, and I don't want to run next week. So um, we'll see if I can find something. We'll figure, we'll figure it out. A little thought ahead to what it's going to take to make an Olympic team, and how close do you think you are to being ready for that? Um, it's just going to take a fast fast time, competitive time. You know, those guys are all veterans. They've all, you know, been running in the pros for 10 years. So those guys will be able to compete. So when it, when it comes time, I just need to be out, go out there and compete. You know, top three make the team, and that's what you know what I'm going for, going for the win. What does it mean to just clean race? No, no I mean, it doesn't have to be. If everybody else is hitting hurdles, you know, the, the playing field is level. What does it mean to score points for your team out here? Uh, it means a lot. You know, it's going to be a lot closer team battle than it was two years ago for sure. So, um, you know, hopefully we have the guys, you know, Marcus is coming up pretty soon. Edward Cheswick coming out there uh, to wrap it up. So we got a few guys that can score some points for us, and hopefully they do well and get the team title again. What's going to happen with football if you make the top three uh, the tries? Uh, I just have to be there probably about 10, 10 days before the first game to try to get in some kind of football shape um, to, to hit it.